all right my dear so in this video tutorial i am going to share with you getting ratio well let me share with you this is one of the most simple as well as this from this topic in gate they have asked many type questions many times and most of the time what do we do we got confused because we don't know exactly the step to remember the getting ratio that's why we try to remember i try to mug up or probably you are thinking why i am talking all these why i am not telling you exactly what i am going to share with you don't worry i am just going to share with you the getting ratio so basically what is this it is the ratio it is the ratio uh i must say among area of sprue as area of sprue first second area of runner ar and third area of gate in ag so there are three things basically and among these three things we are having ratio and we have uh, donate uh, i mean uh, we have uh, no its ratio like this a s yeah so uh, this is a getting ratio right so basically a s uh, ratio a r ratio a g so this is the getting ratio and uh, uh, this is a ratio among a s a r and a g right now most important thing how you can remember this ratio how you can remember this ratio so this is i'm just going to share with you how you can remember about it right so you know a b c d alphabet how we can remember this a b c d alphabet from a, starting from a b c d now see in alphabet what will get first first what will get among these three g definitely then we'll get r then we'll get s 2 and 3 then what will happen what is the meaning of this it it is its meaning that uh, g i just uh, you need to remember what will come first that will come last in this ratio first is g that means in this ratio last will be gate second last that's in middle r and the last one is s so last one will come first middle leave it and the first one will come in the last according to alphabet so in this way you can remember its ratio how you can uh, do ratio right and basically if you you did experiment on this you know, on uh, casting that definitely you can remember without uh, using any tips because you know the process basically right so this is all about getting ratio now there are two things and two types of getting ratio basically we studied one is non pressurized non pressurized and another one is pressurized one is pressurized and another one is non pressurized right so what is non pressurized and what is pressurized that is important so it is depend on the getting ratio too if you are talking about examples if you want to know examples of non pressurized getting system then it's like this one is to two is to three one is to two is to uh, maybe 2.5 1.5 is to 1 is to uh, 2.5. You can say this is these are all examples of non-pressurized gating system. And if you are talking about examples of pressurized gating system, then it is having different. Just like a 3 is to 2 is to 1, 2.5 is to uh, 1 is to 1.5. Uh, It's a non-pressurized gating system. Now next is uh, sorry, pressurized gating system. Now next is 2 is to 2 is to 1. this like you know there are many examples you can give uh, for pressurized gating system so this is how you can you know you can classify types of gating system you can understand types of gating system ratio one is pressurized another one is non pressurized and also you can come to know how to do uh, i mean how to arrange gating ratio right way so this is the right way to do gating ratio right now what i am going to share with you that is also important i am going to share with you two questions those questions has been asked in gate previous year and i am sure this question will be quite i mean uh, i mean will be quite helpful for you too right so what are you waiting for just let's go for it those questions will be here only right so here are those questions so we got this uh, two questions here one is 
the pressure at the gate at uh, at in the gate okay it's the that should not be there you can say at the uh, the pressure at in gate will be maximum will the gating system so you know it is talking about pressurized gating system pressurized gating system so i as i have shared with you here the last az then ar then as area of sprue area of runner area of gate so if they are talking about uh, pressurized gating system that means that means gate one must be minimum at least so among all which one is having gate minimum this one cancel this one cancel this one cancel remaining one is this so one is to two is to one is the right answer that is this is a pressurized gating system okay so probably will uh, you will you know get confused of one is to two is to one so we have to see for pressurized which one is minimum because in the examples so i have shown you in the examples you can see that every example in case of pressurized gating system the gating ratio is minimum the gating that this one is in gate so area of the gate is minimum and it's a ratio of all areas right area of sprue area of runner and area of gate that's why it is known as gating ratio all right so the first question has been solved and i hope you understand the concept to solve problem and i am sure if you will get question in gate upcoming examination then definitely you can solve the problem without any hesitation and you will mark you can mark the right answer right so this is the first question now next move, uh, let's move to the next question what we have in this question in a gating system the ratio of 1 is to 2 is to 4 represent so in a gating system the ratio of 1 is to 2 is to 4 represents so gating system in any gating system what type of ratio we represent basically so what we got here we got four options here a b c d right so in this option what 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 you can do just think about it the ratio is 1 is to 2 is to 4 represents in a gating system what it should be like this okay so uh, the answer would be what you can say that can you guess it so basically if you're talking about non pressurized gating system non pressurized gating system then it's a perfect this is a perfect one so basically in case of non pressurized gating system i mean yeah, it could be pressurized one could be non uh, could be non pressurized one but if you're talking about what type of gating system they are asking this is non press uh, this is non pressurized right because the area of the last one is always area of gate area of gate is maximum that means this is non pressurized gating system so uh, we have to that is not the question they have they have as in this question they have as what time I mean, they are just trying, trying to confuse you by giving you this this so basically what is the ratio of gating i have already shared with you and uh, from this page only you can solve our problems so, all row i have written only two problems so what is the ratio basically area of sprue area of runner and then area of gate okay i have told you also how to remember this ratio so the same ratio we have to get from that from those options so we have given options here so first of all we have to see from last side right so casting area last one uh, this one is wrong and uh, run area this one is wrong casting area wrong so the option is b and now now let's uh, compare with this option b because we are not sitting in the examination we are here to discuss things much better way that's why you can understand things much better way so what we got here just let me use another pen red one is quite good isn't it so sprue area of sprue and runner area of runner and then area of gate so is that is this ratio i have already shared with you as you can see here yes the same ratio i have already shared with you what we got after comparing the uh, written in the written form right so that means we have what answer we have chosen here that is right so in case of getting ratio what is important basically what is important what you have to remember that is also important so first of all you need to remember this ratio first second we need to remember two points when the gate ratio will be getting ratio will be pressurized when the gating ratio will be non pressurized and how to identify i have shared with you that is you have to see that in case of pressurized area of the gate would be minimum 
so in this way you can one thing you need to remember in this way you can solve any problem related to it it's a simple topic i know and i hope you have clear all things in this topic through this video tutorial thanks for watching and see you soon in my next video bye bye